2019. That's why the Department of Homeland Security is advising people to be prepared so they know how to get out alive. Amber Cogliano shows us what to do. Hey guys, we have a shooter. Follow me. It's a routine day at work. Then terror strikes. How do you get out alive? Bill, you hear shots fired. What is the first thing you do? You know where your exits are and you go. Safety expert Bill Stanton showed me ways you can reduce the risk if the unthinkable happens like it did in San Bernardino. Look for a place to hide, but don't stop there. Let's throw the chairs against the door. You want to barricade this as much as humanly possible. You want to flip this table over and you want to get behind it. And you want to set the alarms off. You want to put a flame underneath the sprinkler system. You want to bring as much attention to this situation as humanly possible. Building a barricade is exactly what one police officer advised his son, who was trapped inside the office building in California. Tell him, barricade that door. Get what you can up against that door, and that's what they did. But what if you have nothing to barricade the door with? Here's a tip. Use a belt. If you take a belt and you tighten it on the hinge, they're not going to get through because it's not going to open. And if the gunman breaks through the door, fight back. Nobody go! Use anything you can get your hands on as a weapon, like a fire extinguisher. This fire extinguisher could create a fog and make it slippery for anybody chasing, and then toss it, and then run to the exit. Or scissors. Annie, you need to make that decision to fight for your life, and you want to go for the most vulnerable area possible. You want to take this right in the eye. Right in the eye. Right in the eye, and you want to do it with all your might, because your life may literally depend upon it. Police departments across the country have produced videos showing how to survive a shooting in the workplace. This is from the L.A. Sheriff's Department. Stay behind me. Stay Texas State University posted this video. Lock the doors, turn off the lights, silence your phones, and get out of sight. Come on. Life-saving tips if the worst ever happens to you.